Hey guys, it's me, Kat, and guess what? We got something in the mail. It's my Beauty Alicia Lucky bag for 2020. Yay! I'm so excited. I've been waiting for this for some time, obsessively watching other people's videos. I'm kind of surprised it's Sunday. Hopefully I can edit this real quick and then post it so you guys can check it out. But uh, yeah, I thought it was gonna come yesterday and it didn't, and it came today. So if you're on my channel, I'm a small channel, so I'm assuming you know what this is. I love Beautylish, look at this. Look at that packaging, even signed by someone that packaged it. Hey, Pat McGrath, you should take note. Look how, look fucking, how fucking beautiful, beautiful this is. is. None, None of that, of that stupid, stupid um, um, what is it? Plasticky worm things that gets everywhere. Anyways, let's get into what's in here. Look at again. Beautiful. beautiful. Hey, Pat. Hey, Pat. Pat, Pat. This, this is what is I want out of a bag or uh, a package. Anyways, let me do some predictions because I saw this video and I thought it was very interesting. I'm probably going to get a palette. It better not be Anastasia Beverly Hills because it seems like everyone's getting Riviera or Sultry and I got Sultry last year. Um, I know I'm probably going to get an Orbe texturizing spray, which I won't use. Uh, I think I'm probably going to get good molecules and that frog thing. Everyone seems to be getting that one. And I'll probably get that Hourglass um, little dick lipstick thing. You know, it's long and skinny, but, you know, that's what I think I'm going to get. So let's look at... Oh, but by the way, this is the XL. I did... I was stocking, I had like my alarm set for, to get this when it launched the day after Christmas and I knew it was, the XL was gonna um, sell out. I didn't get it last year, I got it this year, so let's see how lucky I am. Okay, the first thing, I saw this on top, are these Ardell um, individual lashes. I won't use these, so here we go. Oh, Holly Frog, this is what, um, everyone's getting. This is vitamin F therapy balmy wash. Balmy wash. Comes in like a squeezy tube. There's a glare. There you go. So, um, I don't know how I feel about this. I thought this was going to be like a foamy wash. So hopefully I will like, I will definitely, I think I'm going to try this. And then I got a good molecule, see, good molecules, niacinamide brightening toner. I am actually excited about that. I don't think I tried the good molecules last year. I think I gave it to someone, but I don't have a lot of toner. So I'm, I'm, I'll definitely try this. It's very weighty. It's like in a glass container. So that's nice. Oh shit. I got, instead of the spray, I don't think I got the spray. Maybe I, I don't know, but the Oribe repair and restore shampoo which I have a feeling this is like fifty dollars um I tried this as in a sample and I was like oh my god this is so good and I was gonna buy it but it's really expensive so I'm, I'm kind of excited about this no I'm not excited I'm very excited about this guess who else is excited Ripley's excited she's here say hi oh bitch come on <laughs> hi <laughs> I got, what is this? The Sonia G, what's this? Crease One Brush. I have, I think I have this already, so I might share this with my sister, depending on what she gets, because she got the Lucky Bag too, but she got the regular size. So, Jen, let me know. Because honestly, like, this wasn't my favorite brush out of the Sonia G. I saw some people have like the Worker 2 or Worker 1. I like that one better. I was kind of hoping for that one. And then, oh, what did I get? The Latex Love Long Lasting Intense Lip Gloss from Charlotte Tilbury. Um, I don't know how I feel about Charlotte Tilbury because it seems like Everything she produces is more for someone that is, hey guys, my cats are fighting. Everything she produces or comes out with is like gonna be for a very lighter skin tone. She, I don't think she's tan girl friendly. She's definitely not black girl friendly. So look at that. That's gonna look like ash on me. So I guess I'm gonna give that to someone. Or maybe I'll put it in a giveaway. I need to do my giveaway. I, um, I have a whole bunch of stuff I'm gonna give away. Stay tuned for that. I have this Cover FX 
Shimmer Veil. What is this? Celestial. Is this one of those liquid eyeshadows? I just got one from, ooh. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Can I hide my first impression? This is gonna look like, because of my skin tone, I think that's just gonna look silvery on me. I don't know. That'll probably go in a giveaway. And then, ooh, I got the Viseart, Viseart Grand Pro 3. How much is this? It's a lot of money. Let's open it up. Very luxe, and then it comes out. And then it has like a trifold. Ah, uh, ah, uh, I don't know if I'll use this. But it's really pretty. It's got that annoying plasticky thing here, but here we go. <sighs> I mean, I haven't tried this formula. And I understand these mattes are supposed to be where it's at. And we'll see. So that's it, I think. Did I give me anything else? Yeah, that's it. Okay. So what am I excited about? I mean, for the most part, I got this. I think last year I got the box and I didn't keep anything. I might have kept like one or two things. And I gave away the rest. This year I bought it because I know I probably get more joy out of buying it and opening it and seeing what it's all about versus actually keeping a lot of this stuff. So I'll probably give some, put some in my giveaway, things like that. But I am excited about this, the shampoo. I am excited about, well, I'm intrigued by this balmy watch by Holly Frog. And then I, I am happy that I got this brightening toner by Good Molecules. I was kind of, I guess, what did I see? I saw someone getting a mask. I was kind of hoping to get that, but oh well. So I did not get that um, long skinny dick lipstick by Hourglass. I did get a Charlotte Tilbury that looked like Ash. Probably, I'm not gonna try it. Um, maybe I'll try to trade it with some people on the um, buy, sell, trade, or you know, like people that are trading stuff. Uh, this I'm probably not gonna keep. This I'm not gonna keep. The brush I'm excited about because this is a high ticket item. My, I'm gonna see what my sister has because I, I don't think she has tried any Sonia G and I'd like for her to try it. And I mean, this was freaking luxe. I don't know if I'll use this because, oh my God, can you hear my girls? They're so mean. But this is serious. That's beautiful. I just don't know if I'll use it. <laughs> Anyways. That's my unboxing. I feel pretty lucky, feel pretty blessed. It's 2020, Lunar New Year's coming up. I think I'm gonna actually start my new year then. Um, it's Year of the Rat. And anyways, thanks for tuning in. Let me know what you got on in your lucky box, lucky bag, if you got to buy it or if you're bummed that you didn't, sorry. But um, yeah, let me know what you think in the comments. And until next time, I love you guys so much and take care.